Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Voxel Tycoon Charlestown. Now, this is uh, about where we left things off, getting uh, uh, planks uh, delivered up to uh, Oskaloosa, I believe. Now, uh, uh, we've got uh, also uh, iron smelting uh, under research, and we've... Uh, got a massive loan going because we expanded our um, territory. Now, ultimately, uh, I need to uh, ex start exploiting the stone here. Now, uh, in doing so, I'm going to actually flatten this area out. Uh, now, the reason for that is it's going to make it a lot easier to build the quarry. And I'm also going to set this up with uh, a crusher so we can get uh, gravel, uh, ultimately. Uh, but first, uh, I need to uh, flatten this out. Now let's see what it's going to cost to just, yeah, a lot more money than we actually have. Uh, right, so I'm just going to open this up here. And I'm going to up the tempo. Uh, is we just need to have uh, some time pass here. Now, uh, let's just, uh, you know, um, max out the loan uh, so that we have uh, money to play with. Okay, now I'm going to drop this down to water level here. Uh, Oh, I see they uh, did some work with the uh, resource textures so that they uh, they remain when you do landscaping. Uh, okay, so we've got here a... Well, I'm just going to uh, do this. Um, right. Uh, so... Now the idea is I'm going to bring this road over and then I'm going to build a, uh, uh, you know, a, um, whatchamacallit here and, uh, uh, start, uh, exploiting the, uh, the stone by, uh, bringing it to the, um, lab complex. So first of all, get a road over here. Uh, right. I play too many games with the uh, slightly varying uh, controls, so I always forget you have to what you have to do in uh, individual games to cancel tools. Now, I need a, a station. Uh, right. We'll go with the usual uh, station setup I use. Uh, I could count this to uh, to make sure the uh, dope uh, to make sure the uh, um, the grid lines up but it's not uh, critical here uh, I'm also going to uh, drop a warehouse um, just for, uh, uh, okay, that's going to be, st no, stone, uh, now, mining, um, we need mining too, I think, before we can, yeah, before we can actually do anything here, so, uh, we'll just have to uh, wait for uh, our research here to finish, which is just about going to do. Yep. So we'll start a new research. Mining 2, which needs wood beams. Right. Uh, so we'll start that. Um, okay. Now, where is our lab stuff here. Um, 
Okay, I'm just going to put a uh, uh, a warehouse here, and I'm going to have that store wood beams. Now, where's my uh, sawmill facility? That's over here, isn't it? Uh, yes. And we are making wood beams, yes? Yes, we are. Uh, right. Yep. Uh, okay. So, uh, we will, uh, buy a truck which can carry, uh, beams, uh, that one and we'll say beams we'll buy it and uh, okay we'll do a full load here and a full unload way over here by the lab uh, yeah Now, I need to put a uh, drop-off uh, uh, station here, right? Okay, no, wait, come on. Click the right thing, you idiot. Uh, right. That won't be in range. Um, but that works. Okay. Uh, and this is going to, yeah. Uh, okay, so full unload here. Uh, we'll make it a line. Um, right. Yeah, okay. Release the ninjas. Right. Well, that will let, uh, that will let some sort of, uh, um, research, uh, accumulate. Uh, right. Okay. Here, uh, we need, uh, 16 beams for, uh, each step and we need 35 steps for mining to, okay. Mining two will let us exploit the other three resources, uh, you know, stone, sand, and uh, copper. Okay, so um, one more uh, drop off and uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, so it's got to do that 34 more times. In the meantime, uh, we can sit here and uh, watch it. Uh, right. Now, what, what's this? Uh, yeah, okay. We researched iron smelting. Yeah, okay. Uh, we could sit here and watch it, but uh, I want to take a look at... Uh, Okay, that's interesting, but that's not a problem. I want to look at why Oklahoma is building its crossroad down here. And I think the problem is right here. So I'm going to pause and I'm going to take this out and uh, flatten this. Because I think the uh, road uh, point that it wanted to branch at was on the slopes. Okay, now let's uh, let's unpause this. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll do that. Uh, 
Um, right, and while we're waiting, I'll just uh, uh, keep uh, uh, paying things down. Now, iron bar. Am I making iron bars? I didn't set up a smelting operation, did I? No, because I just researched it. Right, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to get distracted. Uh, instead, uh, I'm going to uh, continue uh, uh, paying down the, uh, <clears throat> the uh, money pile while we uh, wait for uh, for the uh, uh, research to uh, proceed. Uh, yeah, uh, so it's, ten, you know, about 10% of the way there. Uh, and I think uh, this should now be able to branch uh, the road along here. Uh, which should make the um, AI a little bit less um, confused. But you know what? No. I'm going to... What? Really? Really? Oh. That is uh, uh, level. Okay. What I'm going to do is uh, level this back just a little bit. Yeah. Then it might build on there. I'll go one more. Yeah, like that. One, two, three, four. Yeah, it has uh, buildings that are four deep. So. Uh, you know, something to do while uh, passing the time. Uh, okay, that's uh, number four of the uh, research steps. It has not earned money. Um, yeah. Well, we'll uh, turn that notification off. That's a new thing uh, in this uh, patch level. Uh, which is kind of nice because we don't need to uh, see those when it's uh, a route that's uh, just uh, uh, passing uh, uh, stuff internally, right? Uh, so supplying hubs and so on, uh, we don't want that to be annoying us with notifications. Okay, well, that's uh, 5 out of 35 done, so that's 1 7th. Look at me, I can reduce fractions. Um, right. Uh, right, anyway, uh, ultimately, we're going to end up with uh, bringing stone down to here. Oh, what I want to do is check, is there any more research that needs iron ore? Uh, rails, roads, steam engine, copper, diesel, steel smelting. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Well, that means I can uh, actually repurpose this. Wait, that was that, that's that, that's that. Uh, uh, repurpose that to coal. And uh, I can send this to a depot. At the coal mine, I guess. Uh, and this I can get rid of that uh, vehicle. Yes. Uh, now, we had a research that wanted coal. 
Uh, steam engine. Yes. Anyway. Uh, oh, right. Um, which one wanted stone? Uh, Rhodes 2 wants stone. Rails 2 wants stone. Okay. Well, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to set up a, a, a line that brings stone down, even though we can't do anything with it yet. Okay, so that's going to be uh, this one. And it's going to be stone. We're going to buy one. Uh, and it's going to be full load here and full unload uh, over here. Uh, make it a line and well, release the ninjas. Uh, right now, if I'll go, I'll go back up here. This one. I will mute notifications on. Uh, right, okay. So that's ready as soon as I, I can drop in a uh, quarry. Um, well, that hasn't done anything here. Um, it should eventually. Uh, anyway, uh, right. Uh, Okay, uh, over here. Uh, okay, we've done eight of uh, of thirty five there. Nine now. Okay, the loan is clear. Uh, right. Well, that means uh, when, once this uh, finishes. Uh, we'll be able to uh, to just uh, well, I suppose uh, you know, just get get things rolling uh, without having to worry too much about uh, about cash. Uh, that's uh, kind of good. Um, yeah, ultimately, uh, I'm going to want to get a smelting operation underway, but. Uh, I want to get some other technological developments underway first. Um, that's, uh, oh, there's sand up there. That one has wood. That one has stone, obviously. What's this one have? Copper. Uh, and that one's coal. Okay. This is actually kind of a good spot for a stone uh, quarry uh, is what we can do is uh, if we set up our manufacturing over here we can act this is actually close enough to conveyor stone in um, yeah uh, uh, I think it'll need uh, one two relay points to do uh, anyway right um, yeah, that's uh, taking along. Okay. Well, let's just, uh, whoops, there we go. Let's just, uh, can we, uh, we can turn off, uh, Uh, we turn this stuff off and we okay so now we've got a uh, that's kind of a interesting view isn't it uh, right uh, okay so the headquarters can be upgraded that's this here, right? Uh, now, if we upgrade, 
Um, well. 9.5 million value needed for the next upgrade. Okay. I wonder if this is an open-ended upgrade path or if it uh, always, uh, or if it has a max. Um, that's, uh, that's an interesting question to uh, sort of ponder. Um, right. Close that. Okay, so it, all that stuff is off, but we can see it if I hold Alt. If I press Alt, so we can toggle between the two states. Uh, so that's actually uh, that's actually not a bad idea. Right. Um, okay, we're we're a third of the way done here. And yeah, we're more than a third of the way done. Uh, okay, so so Charlestown. Um, you know what? I'm gonna turn on cities. Yeah. Uh, that's just for being able to find my bearings, right? Uh, having the uh, the cities. Uh, okay. Uh, business in Oskaloosa went uh, went under. You know that's fine. There was no way it was going to uh, to work anyway. Uh, but uh, as you can see, uh, these uh, some of these uh, neighboring. Well, the initial region neighbors. Um, see, they all they all show uh, demands. But uh, they're basically frozen until you acquire the region. Uh, so I assume it's part of the region seed or something like that that uh, sets those. And until you uh, open the region up, you uh, buy into it. Uh, I would assume that... Uh, uh, there's no record of the terrain, uh, but once you uh, open up the region, uh, it generates the map, uh, and uh, I assume that's where you get the uh, 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 the terrain into the game, right? Uh, because it's a procedurally generated uh, map where... Um, Uh, where you, as far as I know, uh, you can uh, expand indefinitely as long as you can acquire the uh, money uh, to uh, grab a new region, and your uh, computer has the resources to uh, handle it. Uh, but it does take quite a lot of resources to handle a non-trivial map. Um, uh, you know, as it expands. You know, I'm not running a potato by any uh, definition. And uh, it's not uncommon for me to have lag on these larger maps. So uh, it wouldn't surprise me in the least. Right. Okay. Well, we're up to 15. Um, yeah. Uh, so what do I want to uh, continue with here? Well, I think I'll uh, do a little bit of uh, townscaping here. Um, so like Oklahoma City here uh, has uh, these uh, businesses here, but otherwise uh, it's, uh, well, it's going to have trouble when it grows in this direction. Uh, but something that um, is going to have even more trouble growing this direction 
And I can see ultimately Oskaloosa and uh, Oklahoma City are going to end up running together. Uh, but what I what I want to do uh, is uh, before uh, too much uh, development gets uh, going out here, uh, I want to flat some of this out. Uh, now, uh, I'm doing this for a couple of reasons. Uh, one of them is that uh, uh, it'll make it easier when I need to, when I come back to retrofit rail lines through. Uh, but it will also wait what uh, get out of there uh, okay uh, okay I'm gonna down tempo this while I mess around here uh, right it'll also make um, having the town road grid expand uh, a little less uh, uh, dodgy uh, right okay uh, right uh, by having the uh, roads basically at water level it allows me to build uh, rail viaducts and embankments all the way through developed areas and be able to use bridges or tunnels uh, between uh, which uh, uh, because we don't have level crossings right now it I found is the uh, easiest way to to just get uh, uh, rail through a dense population area and it looks quite impressive ultimately as well uh, right now here's the thing uh, the town will be quite happy with these things here up on this two uh, two voxel uh, cliff uh, but if I remove them it will rebuild uh, lower down now the one thing is you can't uh, remove uh, businesses this way um, right okay so now if I uh, do the flatten thing here right so now we've got this flat space facing the water um, and the roads uh, more importantly, will be at the uh, level that I want them at. Now you don't need to do this, of course, and you probably don't wouldn't want to. Uh, but it's uh, it's something that I like to have a flat area, especially around my uh, uh, factory setups. Uh, it makes expansion a lot easier. Uh, right. Uh, and of course, flattening things out later can be a, a right pain, um, especially as uh, businesses uh, appear on the map. Now, while I'm at this, I'm going to uh, count the... Um, this is the long dis uh, the long blocks, right? Yep. So I'm going to count this out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. So that's a road. Um. <sighs> right. Uh, okay, so one, 
two, three, four, five, six. All right, and then one, two, three, four, six. Now, how, let's see how close I got that. One, two, I didn't, as you can see. I'm uh, off by one. Anyway, so that, no. Oh, come on, no. Um, okay, one, two, that's a road. That's a road. That is not a road because this should be over by one. Um, right. Well, can I uh, tell it to uh, skip current order? Pause. Uh, okay. Blow that up. Blow that up. Blow that up, and that, and that. Okay, now I can line it up properly. Uh, no, I want uh, road. Now I'll uh, I'll do this. Uh, right now, uh, I'll put it here yep and then I'll put it put this back and I will also um, write uh, no it's in here um, warehouses right uh, rotate nope so I'll put that there. That will be stone. Okay. So this um, this shows um, how you can uh, get the uh, the grid uh, lined up. Uh, so that your uh, roads don't uh, interfere with where the towns want to build. Uh, there is one more thing, though. Uh, uh, you might um, want to prevent, because the towns will also extend existing roads. So when uh, Oklahoma no City North gets uh, here, it would have extended this road out. Now, just putting an object there will prevent that. So, in this case, dropping a pumpkin there will prevent the road from being extended. And it only takes up one, uh, one voxel, so it's not a uh, significant um, impediment to uh, town development. Okay, uh, so th there, that's uh, a tutorial on the, uh, the grid, right? And... Uh, lining things up. Now, by lining it up this way, you can get a station and a road, the, the station bit and the road, and you can get a, a second, you can get two of them between on the long block plus a third one on the through road. Um, so, uh, and uh, by lining it up against the uh, the grid like this, uh, you can allow the uh, efficient transit of your traffic filtering through the uh, the overall network. 
uh, in such a way that uh, you don't end up blocking anything. Now, I saw up here, we got wood beam being accepted here. Now, wood beam is in the 100% range. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring wood beams up to Oskaloosa, right? Uh, so we'll buy a truck and it's going to need to be that one. Wood beams, buy it. Uh, we'll, uh, no, we're not copying it yet. We're doing a full load here. And then we'll go up here to Oskaloosa. We'll do full unload here. Uh, we'll make a line out of it. Now, how far is that? Eh. Um, how many do I have on this one? Four. Yeah, okay. Uh, copy, copy, copy. Yeah, we'll do that. Release the ninjas. Okay. Well, that should get us uh, more um, cash coming in, as if we need it. Uh, okay. Uh, that's uh, bringing in a fair chunk of cash. Okay. Well, we'll leave that... Uh, that going well that will get us uh, more going now let's uh, take a look here it looks like yeah it looks like it's uh, keeping up so that's that's good yep uh, so the uh, sawmill operations are keeping up uh, so this will uh, allow Oskaloosa there to level up a bit. Uh, here we go. Is that there before? No, I don't think it was. Maybe it was. Anyway, uh, Oklahoma City should uh, there be another uh, crossroad in here. Um, now I want to take a look here. Uh, now let's see. Okay, that went bankrupt. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, Charlestown is, it's not, you know, losing a bunch of money, but it's, uh, oh, I want to change this. Um, Uh, is that the one? Yeah. Okay. I wonder if it remembers that. Anyway. Um, yeah. Uh, right. Well, that's... Uh, that's going uh, reasonably well. Um, we're at 26 of 35 on mining two. You know, I could could have made that go a lot faster by uh, putting a second truck on the uh, beams. But as I said in the previous parts, uh, I'm trying to avoid um, uh, just wiping out the cash and uh, getting through the... Uh, the research tree, you know, as fast as possible. You know, that's not the uh, the style I'm going for here. Now you can see there's quite a bit of uh, traffic on uh, some of these roads here. Uh, this is actually why I'm going to uh, assist the uh, towns in maintaining their grid structure as the uh, 
as they grow and as I uh, add more uh, traffic to the uh, network. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is uh, it, that will ultimately allow more pathways for the traffic to take and there will be fewer choke points like this road here. Yeah, okay, so uh, right, anyway, uh, so that was uh, a look at uh, you know, my, uh, you know, flatten the, uh, the town out to uh, uh, allow the, uh, the grid to work better. Now, a lot of the time I won't bother with that. Uh, I'll just uh, uh, make sure that the intersection points uh, can actually build intersections. Uh, right. Oklahoma City is now accepting stone, which we can't mine yet. And I don't think we'll be able to before the business goes away. Uh, but if it doesn't go away too fast, um, where's the uh, station here? It's right here. Uh, yeah, it's not in range. So we'll end up dropping a station over here. Well, maybe on here. Yeah, uh, that's probably what will happen. Uh, anyway. Uh, next time, uh, I'll definitely be, uh, we'll definitely have mining too, and I'll be able to, uh, build the, uh, quarry up here, and then we'll get, uh, stone coming down to here. And the first thing I'll do, I think, is, uh, uh research what's needed for crushing, um, and then uh, from there, uh, I'll probably do the road and rail too. Anyway, uh, that's going to be that's going to be all for uh, for this part. You know, not a lot has uh, really happened here. Uh, we uh, established another uh, industry. Uh, or business uh, delivery point. Uh, messed around with uh, research a bit. Uh, uh, prepared for the uh, stone quarry. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, that's about that. Uh, so I guess, uh, you know, stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And I'll see you back next week for another episode.